mutual fund SIP and how to invest. Naveen's super cool brother tells his father that he started a SIP. Naveen, who is sipping a juice, asks why this commotion about sipping on a juice. Naveen's brother says, it's not a juice we are talking about. We are talking about an investment option called Systematic Investment Plan or SIP. Naveen's father starts explaining about SIP. He says, mutual funds are investment vehicles where thousands of people pool in their money and people who are experts manage the portfolio and invest into financial instruments like stocks, bonds and other securities and the returns are in turn shared between the investors. Systematic Investment Plan or SIP is a tool to invest into mutual funds. In an SIP, you invest on a regular basis in mutual fund and could start with just 500 rupees every month. The SIP amount will get auto-debited from your account. Naveen's father explains that he needs to do a Know Your Customer or KYC by filling out a form with his photograph and ID and address proof. Once the KYC is done and updated in the system, he can invest through SIP into any mutual fund online at the mutual fund website or through a platform or offline through a financial advisor. The best thing about SIP is that it makes you more disciplined. It makes sure you save before spending as your account gets debited automatically once you sign up for the SIP. It takes emotions out of the investment equation as your money gets invested on a fixed date irrespective of the market movement. The biggest advantage of the SIP is rupee cost averaging which means that your cost gets averaged. What this means is that when the market rises, your existing units gain more value and when the market drops, you gain more units for your monthly amount, thus averaging out your purchase price. SIP helps you achieve your financial goals through the power of compounding. But for this, one must start investing early and remain invested for the long term. For example, if you invest 10,000 rupees per month for 20 years, you would have made almost a crore at 10%. Every five years that you delay investing, the amount to be invested to reach the same goal doubles. While choosing a SIP, remember to look for schemes whose performance have been consistent over the long term and do not go by the past one year returns. One must also keep in mind that if the market fails, one must not exit the SIP but remain invested to reap the benefits of getting more units for the same amount.